Welcome back. The Sri Sri Institute of Management Studies is organizing a day-long event with the theme India Lies in You on the 5th April at the National Institute of Oceanography. The theme of the event is inspired by the motion picture Swadesh. The program intends to make every individual in India matter and make them responsible citizens so that each person in their own little way can contribute towards making a shining India. One of the students elaborated on the theme. We have a very, you know, we have a, we have a habit of sitting back on our chairs and complaining about the political system not doing anything, the government is not doing anything. But do we really look internally? Do we look at ourselves as to how much are we contributing to the nation in our own way? So this is an initiative which we took. We thought that we need to spread an awareness across, make people realize that yes, we in our own ways can make a difference to the society around us. The day-long event is open to graduates and postgraduates. The participants are required to choose a clipping from the 10 scenes provided on the website www.indialiesinhue.com and present the paper explaining why you chose the scene what inference one draws from it and how you would address the issue. The shortlisted contestants will get an opportunity to present their papers before the judges which will be followed by a panel discussion with the panel members. It's a theme of the event. In the morning, rooms from across everywhere and there will be a panel discussion. Now our panel members would include Dr. Kiran Bedi, uh, India's first IPS woman officer, Mrs. Vasanthi Hari Prakash. She is a radio jockey at Radio City and uh, she has also been awarded India's best English RJ. And this is Mr. Jagdish Kini. He was the ex CEO of Airtel and Gillette. Currently, he is the CEO of Enterprise 5C. These are our other three panel, uh, panel members Mr. Umesh Brahmi. He is the HSBC Senior Vice President for Corporate Sustainability and he's contributed uh, for CSR activities at HSBC in a large way. This is Mr. Gaurav Kwatra. He is a 26-year-old youngster who's so enthusiastic towards life. He is an IITN from Delhi. He was working abroad. He came back to India. He's located in Bombay. He will be coming down for the event to moderate. Before we end, here's a reminder of the headlines. Banauli villagers object to hot mixing of road before widening it. PWD minister's official car blocked from proceeding to his residence. Churchill threatened to resign. Chief minister rushes to his residence. Government to hand over investigation into Scarlet's rape and murder to CBI. High court issue show cause notice to government over controversial housing project. That's all in today's bulletin. If you have a story that needs to be told, an issue that needs to be highlighted, email us at goa365 at redofmail.com or call us on 32903335. Until then, goodbye and good night.